one example of how I've kind of attempted to uncover a misconception is by using a concept cartoon with GCSE students a couple of weeks ago about mutations. I was trying to uncover the misconception that mutations are always bad. Um, so I created a concept cartoon in which I had different statements looking at what a mutation does in terms of how it alter alters the protein structure. So I had one that talked about mutations always altering the protein structure, always rendering a protein kind of unfit for purpose, and then others just slightly nuanced, so not always causing a problem, but whenever they that whenever a mutation was present, it did cause a change, whether or not that change was a problem or not. And then the correct answer that actually mutations can happen and not cause any change at all. Um, and really just delving into that mutation being a change in the base sequence that might cause a change in the protein structure, but not always. I think that was a really useful exercise because by doing that first, it then meant when we did look at when mutations do cause a change in protein structure, that wasn't the first thing that pupils thought and learnt and therefore the, the one thing that they, they kind of believed. So I think it really helped to set the scene for teaching about mutations. To complete a concept cartoon and identify the wrong answers, I used examiner's reports about um, previous um, things that students have got wrong when it comes to mutations. I also just really simply typed in misconceptions in teaching genetics to GCSE and found um, blog posts and found kind of lists of possible misconceptions um, and used those.